Good afternoon. This is International Language Testing System powered by IDP to access the level of the candidate. My name is Kamal Rana and I am here to conduct the speaking of candidate number 3013. This is examiner Kamal. How may I address you? You may call me first name Simran. Simran. Does your name have any special meaning? Yes, of course, my name is a special meaning. When I was 8th standard, I searched on Google as well as I told my mother what is my name meaning. That's time my mother told me my name meaning. That's remember okay. to What her. are some similarities and differences you have seen between Indian and Western names? Uh, yes, there are huge differences that mean the Indian and the Western name because uh, mostly Indian people give a name with a special meaning as compared to foreign, which is a uh, name meaning is not a uh, much meaning related to the uh, greater the novels as well as uh, as compared to Indians. What do you do? Uh, now I am student. I recently completed my senior secondary education. Okay. Do you live in the city or village? I come from a countryside area. I come from a Ranmati, is located on Ludhiana to Chandigarh Highway. Tell me something interesting about your hometown. Uh, I come from a countryside area. It is very beautiful town. All around 800 people live there. There are some places which are very beautiful such as park, library as well as three Sikh temples are there. Do you think your hometown is special for you? Yes, of course, my hometown is special for me because I lived since there my birth. So there are some places which are very interesting and beautiful, and I like to spend the many most of the time at their garden. What is the one thing you don't like about your hometown, and why? Uh, mostly, I like all all the things in my hometown. But uh, one of the thing I do not like at my hometown is the transport system. The, uh, there are the transport system very poor, so I like to I like to go application of our government to uh, to shoot the repair of my transport system as well as uh, also provide uh, more dustbin at at my village to to in order to keep clean. Okay, now I like to ask some question about toys. And my first question is, what the difference between girls and boys toys? Uh, due to modern era, there were not difference between the girls and boys the toys. So mostly girls uh, like to, go, to like to play toys with Barbie dolls as well as soft toy types such as teddy bears and uh, uh, other kind of cartoons. But as compared to boys, uh, but however, boys like to uh, play with the hard hard toys such as machines uh, and uh, other uh, uh, other body toys. Do you think toys really help kids in mental development? Uh, yes, of course, to be honest, uh, play, toys play an important role in children's development. Uh, such as when uh, they were they was child, uh, they can play with toys as well as learn more skills uh, which they develop their mental and uh, uh, mental uh, stability. Okay, does modern technology have an influence on kids' toys? Uh, yes, of course, modern technology includes more kinds of toys as compared to past. Uh, yeah, I remember in past uh, mostly toys are uh, made by wooden as well as cotton, but nowadays mostly toys are uh, made by machines as well as uh, remote cars. But what toys are popular with kids in India or in your area nowadays? Uh, in my country, it depends on people to people choice which kinds of toys they play. But mostly uh, in nowadays, uh, machine toys as well as automatic to toys are famous in my country. Did you enjoy playing with uh, many toys when you were a child? Uh, yes, of course, I vividly remember that when I was child, I had a huge, uh, huge uh, collection of toys. I, I love to play with the uh, various type of uh, toys uh, as well as uh, I remember that I have a kitchen set, Barbie dolls as well as automatic cars. Okay, which do you think is better for children to play with toys alone or with other kids? What is your opinion? Uh, to be honest, uh, I personally feel that uh, uh, if children can play with toys with the others, they can learn how they can contribute in the group play as well as uh, they can learn the discipline which they can play in a group rather than alone. Okay, that's all for the first section. So now it's time to discuss the second part of the RS speaking test. This section is known as individual long term and in this section you will be given one cue card topic and you will have on one minute to organize your ideas. If you want to make some notes, we have paper and pencil placed on the table. And do not touch it, I will allow you. And today your topic is, describe a plan you have for the future. 
not related to work or study. And here is the two part. And your time starts now. Stop writing. Could you please start now? Read the note there and start speaking. I always have been interested to attend short time courses to acquire my knowledge as well as ability. But here I would like to talk about a course which is not related to my study as well as my work. It is a plan about cooking classes. Due to I remember that due to Corona pandemic situation, government announced all around the world lockdown. So that time I always at my home. I feel I felt very bored because I always spend time on on my mobile phone to scroll videos. So I like to join some short time course so that. So that's time I joined to join, uh, uh, to join online cooking classes with the help of internet, uh, which is very fruitful for me in my future life because that's time I go, I jo I asked to go abroad as well uh, to go abroad. So that's time my mother is not along with me. So the so it is very fruitful for me and helpful for me in my future life. Uh, do not depend me on the other to make uh, and prepare my food. Uh, so I join uh, Sanjeev Kapoor online videos uh, with the help of the internet. I I scroll many videos and know how to how how about the make foods with himself. Uh, moreover, I take many classes online uh, at uh, Sanjeev Kapoor sir. It is uh, he is very professional in a in a chef. Uh, furthermore, I like to uh, furthermore it is very enjoyable classes enjoyable classes uh, because I learn how I, I learn firstly I learn the art about the in these ingredients. After that, I make a small cake at my mother's birthday. It is very tasty, so that was the course. It is not related to my study as well as the work. I like to join. Okay, just for for the second part. Now it's time to discuss second, third part of the Alice speaking test. This section is known as follow-up discussion, and now I'd like to ask some question about future aspects. Do you think long-term future plan and short-term future plans are important? Uh, yes, of course. Short time future plans are very play, play an important role in everyone's life because they can learn many skills as well as uh, experiment uh, in short time course as well as compared to long time course. Uh, due to for example, due to Corona pandemic, many people like to join uh, some courses related to their profession as well as their hobbies. Uh, they can join short time courses with the help of internet, internet, which is very beneficial. Such as many people like to join cooking classes as well as art craft and other hobbies. Okay, what do you mean by short-term future plan and long-term future plan according to you? Uh, to according to my perception, long time uh, future plans related to their work as well as study. Uh, but as compared, but uh, however, some small plans related to their uh, some uh, such as some people plan to about about now what beach can do next day as well as uh, sometimes they can plan about the go outside. Uh, is it is a short time course, but uh, if they plan a long time, this related to their future as well as their work study, which how to do uh, do in their future life. Okay, which is better? According to you, having a lot of plans or having no plans at all? Uh, to be honest, it is important to having a lot of plan rather than no planning because uh, if people can plan uh, their future life, they can achieve to and uh, they can work hard to achieve that goal uh, rather than if they have no ambition in their life, they cannot get hard work as well as to achieve their goal. Do you often make plans before outing anywhere or not? Yes, of course, I make make plans when I go outside with my friends as well as my family member. Mostly, sometimes or when I go to shopping with my family members, I lost some things when I remember that, so I make small list to prepare before the shopping. 
Okay, why do most people make plans before they go for travel? Uh, sometimes people can make plans when uh, before the before the tra traveling because sometimes they can also and uh, do not remind some things which they can do on their travel as, uh, as well as so they can prefer to make some small list on their mobile phones as well as their diary. Okay, some people believe planning help people to prepare for unseen travels. What is your opinion? That's a question. Do you think planning help people for unseen travel? Yes, of course, it is important to people to make to make a list to unseen travels because sometimes people can have not prepare for the travels. So they if they can make a small list, they can travel anything. It is easy. Okay, what do you think people do when they face unpredictable issues? Uh, they face many problems when they face un unjust problems such as sometimes they can uh, uh, face many problems in a, uh, in the front of the audience sometimes uh, for example in school uh, sometimes teacher ask their students uh, for immediately they uh, ask they tell speech at the front of the uh, whole school so that time the student can feel very nervous as well as uh, uh, they feel very stressed because they have not any preparation uh, they how they how they speak how do speech at the front of whole school? Okay, do you think being unsuccessful is a sign of pure, a poor future planning? Uh, no, uh, sometimes uh, people can be unsuccessful in our uh, achieve goals, but uh, it is not a, a poor future because uh, sometimes it's that situation which can people unsuccessful due to their some reasons. Uh, uh, so it is uh, not a poor future because they can uh, work hard to achieve their goals in their future life. Okay. That's all for the follow-up discussion and today's I speaking test. You can leave now. Thank you.